Everybody excited to be back in school? Exactly. Middle school is always honest. Elementary school, uh, yeah. Elementary school, everybody's always happy all the time, and, and you know everything is always yes to the answers. Middle school, though, y'all shoot it straight, right? All right. So here's something that I always like to do during the school year is go around and talk to the kids at the grade level that uh, you guys know that you have the middle school district teacher of the year, Mr. Veter, right? Okay, yep. So, during the year, I always try to make an appearance and, and talk to the kids about how important it is to recognize the great teachers that you have, and then your teachers recognize the great teachers that they think through a process to get them to be the teacher of the year for your school. And then there's a big process that goes on about being the teacher of the year for the level. And now you guys actually have the Cobb County School District Teacher of the Year. So once everybody has got their teacher of the year for the school and then the, the level winners are announced and now the district level teacher of the year is announced, he gets to go compete to try to be the teacher of the year for the entire state of Georgia. How cool would that be, right? But the coolest thing for me, because I'm a car guy, is Mr. Veter, because he was a level district teacher of the, year, of the year, Ed Voles is going to allow him to drive a car for free for a year. How cool is that? See, when we get to the high school teacher of the year, I get a better response. You guys will get there. So. Again, I just want to congratulate Mr. Veter, congratulate Dodgen, Principal Hill, and you've got some, some family that is always, also snuck in behind you, um, your mom. <laughs> yep. So, again, you guys should, could not be more proud, I know, like I am, to have Mr. Veter represent not only the middle school level teacher of the year for the district, but the district teacher of the year and to be able to represent our district in the state competition. No pressure, but, <laughs> but should you win the, dis the state teacher of the year, you get to keep the car forever. Right. How cool is that? All right. Congratulations, man. Now it's a speech time. Well, again, I don't have a speech prepared like I did two weeks ago. Uh, I feel so honored and, and uh, blessed. And uh, I've been so lucky. I have my two families. I have my family and my mom and my late father and my two sisters who have always been so loving and supportive. My mom is a former seventh grade math teacher. And uh, they say it's still going to be something <laughs> wonderful to follow. Then I'd like to talk about the Dodson family that I've been a part of. This is my 16th year. Uh, there's, there are so many wonderful teachers in this school that I've taken so much from. And uh, they say it, it takes a village to raise a child. Well, it takes an entire school to make any teacher. And whether it's support staff, uh, administration, and the teachers, and most importantly, the kids that I've been able to teach over the 15 years is just 
is blessing beyond belief. And uh, I'm just so honored tonight. I hope I make you proud. <laughs> I, I don't know about this faith thing, but I just, I mean, this is just uh, an unbelievable, unbelievable feeling. And this is, it's, I don't feel it's my award. I think feel it's Dodgeon's award, whether it's support staff, uh, previous and past, uh, previous, I mean, past and present administrators and teachers. I want to thank all of them, but this is a Dodgeon award, and I'm just a part of the family, and you are too. And thank you for everything you've ever given me. Congratulations, man. Thank you. Awesome job. Appreciate it. Back to you.